right, welcome back guys to some more slam dunk. Your boy needs some lotion, but I'm not in the mood. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show you guys, okay? Black people get ashy, you should know by now, <laughs> okay? Your boy, I just took a bath before I let daddy. I was like, listen man, I need to get on these reactions. Completely forgot to put lotion on. <laughs> but you definitely know your boy getting the rub down as soon as as I finish with these reactions. Anyways, guys, welcome back. No, a lot of you guys been asking me, where are the slam dunk reactions, man? Where are the slam dunk reactions? Uh, yeah, I did put out a notice, you guys, and that's why I told you guys to watch my update videos, but you refuse to do so. And even if, even some people do, and it's like they're skimming through it to see if anything pertains to them. <laughs> and then they probably miss the entire point of the video. It's just like, man, you know, but in any case, guys, I'm always happy to answer those questions and let you guys know when things are coming back. If we do take a break from them. So we did take a week off and was streaming every night. I think, I think we skipped two of those nights or just one i think it was like two of those nights we skipped i was supposed to stream every night um but we did enjoy it very much so we are back on that reaction stuff um every show should be on schedule do schedule um and we'll see how that turns out anyways guys we are going to jump into some slam dunk we already know the official game the boys are in the game the official starting five of shoko let's get it man and i will see you guys for the review all right so two more episodes down 30 30 and 31 um love those two episodes very exciting i was very anxious to um to see them play and they're doing pretty good they took the lead they went up by 20 and then this guy came in the game and brought the other team back into the game uh i didn't think we would have had that this much conflict after they came in but hey i'm all for it um to see what they're going to do how they're going to adjust and move ahead because it's, it's win or go home at this point you know what i'm saying it's not a you know best two out of three or best three or five you know it's either you win the game or you lose and you go home so i don't know you know what i'm saying uh how it's going to go hoping that choco will will pull it out and win rukawa seems like he's going to be an issue because they're talking about him a lot as in he seems like you know he's a flashy player um you know but he needs to be more of a team player you know everybody else is kind of like playing on a team except him you know what i'm saying he's kind of like out there just kind of grab any opportunity that he gets to shine and make the flashy play you know um so i don't know if he's gonna become a problem but he really does need to, you know, be more ingratiating with his teammates and get to know his teammates. Because, I mean, you, you, you know how it goes. It's not going to be all, you know, it, it's not going to be all roses and stuff like that. They're not going to mesh immediately. Um, you know, and sometimes you, you're going to have people like that on the team that is just there. They're just did us there because this is just a stepping stone to my greatness so uh i don't care about y'all I'm, I'm gonna get mine i'm gonna get mine you know what i'm saying he, and he, he comes off as that type of player um but i don't think that's who he is i think he just pretends to not care in the same way i would say in a sense like how um i think when it comes on to I, I was thinking of suki i was thinking of sukishima from from haikyuu but I don't think I don't think it would be comparison there. I don't think it's the same thing. Cause Suki had a love he had a love for volleyball. Um he just he he he, he just didn't want to. There was a there was there was a a inner passion that he has for for the for the sport of volleyball, but he just 
didn't want to care too much or show that he cared too much because of the incident with his brother but with this is a little different with with rukawa um i think he loves the game of basketball but i think he's selfish about it you get what i'm saying i think he's very selfish about it as in as i said before he's using everything as a stepping stone to get to his greatness he doesn't really care you know what i'm saying like he doesn't really care but i think he does that's the thing about it. like i think he does but i think he just gives off this d demeanor of being i'm me i'm the superstar you know what i'm saying um so i don't know what to think of him yet completely to be honest but we'll we'll see how it goes but in any case guys they are taking the steps forward i'm looking forward to them doing more with this series and see where it goes you guys said this is the greatest sports anime of all time i have yet to see that but at the same time i can see that it's going in that in that direction where i can clearly say after you know watching a couple more sports anime it um you know i can say even i could put it and say that it's better than say a ippo or you know what I'm saying? Oh, or Haikyuu. I don't know. I don't know. I don't see that yet. But, you know, as I said, it's, it's going in that direction. But we'll see when it's over what I have to say. Um, you know, whatever that was not animated and it's in the manga, I will definitely... I probably won't react to it or do a read-through of the manga. But I'll probably just read it on my own time and then give you guys a review. Um, depending on how much how many chapters after the anime is finished there is then I'll probably go in that depending on how much there is if it's a lot you know if it's a lot then I'll probably do a read through of it but if it's not if it's not a lot then I'll just read it on my own time and give a review of the entire series but we'll see how it goes anyways guys thank you guys so much not much to say here in the review um, the game is is basically tied they brought this new guy in this skinhead even though i don't even know if i can say that on youtube because it's a derogatory term for um for white people i think <laughs> um <laughs> yeah it is actually it is but um hey <laughs> i don't even know i don't even think i can do say that on youtube to be honest but we we'll know in this politically correct world that we live in right now like who knows you know i just say whatever i want to say but anyways thank you guys so much i appreciate you guys like the video leave a comment of course and i will catch you guys for some more slam dunk on thursday i appreciate you guys peace out